second graders, Mrs. Shook again. We're on grade two scales, unit two, lesson 14. Our learning goals for today, review all of the letter sounds, finish our editing and finalization of the drafts for our book report, and then read and match antonyms. We're going to figure out if the pairs that we have are antonyms or not. Our vowel sound review, we're going to go through all the vowel sounds in preparation for our upcoming assessment. For the a eh sound, the only spelling is the letter A. Eh? So far we've gone over the letter E, which is the most common spelling. I is usually spelled with an I. Ah, like in hop, is O. Ah, like in butt, is U. A, the long A sound, like in cake, which is an A with a consonant and then a magic E at the end. I, or excuse me, I, like in bite, I with a consonant and a magic E at the end. O, like in home, again O with the magic E at the end, consonant in the middle. U, again the U with the magic E at the end, making the U sound. We have three spellings for the long E sound. We have the E with the magic E at the end, E-A and E-E. -E. The double O spelling can either say ooh like in soon or uh like in look. And we have two spellings for ow, O-U and O-W. Two spellings for oi, O-I like in oil and O-Y like in toy. Er, we have E-R, the most common spelling. Or, the most common being O-R. R, the only spelling is A-R. Okay, now for antonyms. Those are when words have the opposite meaning, like sunny and cloudy. So, you'll see a set of words on the screen. Thumbs up if it's an antonym pair. Thumbs down if they're not opposites. Right versus wrong. Thumbs up or thumbs down. Are those opposite? Good. They are opposites. They're antonyms. How about sad and smart? Are those opposites? Are those antonyms? Good. They are not. The opposite of sad would be happy. The opposite, not smart. How about tall and short? Thumbs up if it's antonyms. Thumbs down if they're not. Good. Tall and short are opposites. They're antonyms. How about slow and Cold. Are those opposites? No. The opposite of slow would be fast, and hot is the opposite of cold. These two words are not antonyms. How about hot and fast? Again, nope. Up and down. Yeah. Now and later. Open and shut. Are they antonyms or not? Yes, they are. Okay. You're going to continue doing this um, on the activity page. So you're going to match the antonym on the left, or the word on the left with its antonym on the right. So on the left, we have inside, soft, add, good, short, shout, pointed, and hot. On the right, it's bad, long, cold, rounded, hard, Subtract, outside, and whisper. You'll see they did number one. So number one is inside, and then they marked outside as number one, because inside and outside are opposites. So you're just going to match the words that make the antonym pair. All right, so we planned, we drafted, finishing our editing. Here is our planning page, our draft, our editing checklist. You're going to continue to edit your piece. You're gonna edit, you're gonna have a, once you edit, you're going to then take all of your edits and rewrite it to make a final draft. So if you had to change spelling, you had to cross things out, move things around, whatever you had to do, you can take all of those changes and rewrite it into a final draft to submit. Okay? And that's all. Make sure you do Google Forms for Lesson 14. Bye!